Hey everybody, Matt with Octo Aquatics here. One of the most common questions that gets asked is can a blue diode laser cut or engrave acrylic? This It is a, a broad general question and the answer is sometimes. So what we're going to do today is test these various colors of acrylic to see what will cut and or engrave and what won't. This video isn't going to be covering the science behind it because it's kind of dry and probably uh, above most of your heads, but it has to do with light absorption, light reflection, the dyes that are used in the acrylic itself, and the manufacture of the acrylic. So, uh, for example, not all materials are exactly the same. Not all wood is exactly the same. Not all types of wood are the same even when they come from the same tree not even every piece is the same same with acrylic acrylic can vary from manufacturer to manufacturer and even from batch to batch within the same manufacturer even if it's supposed to be the same stuff so what i have here today is a bunch of cell cast acrylic that's very important it is not extruded cell cast is higher quality Cell cast acrylic, 1 8 inch thick, or approximately 0.118 inch thick. And uh, these are sample pieces I bought from an acrylic supplier here in the U.S. We're going to run through it, each one and see how they perform. There are two colors I'm not going to include in this test, and that's going to be white and uh, this, this ivory as well. That's going to be similar to white and, and not give us any results. So I'm going to start off with the black though, because we, we already know, right? The black, black's really laser friendly with the blue diode laser at least. So we'll start off with that and then we'll work our way through the colors and see how we do. I will put the settings on the screen uh, that I'm using for each and I'm not sure how many different tests I'm going to be doing on each before I consider it a failure. Let's get to testing.
right, there you go. Did any of those results surprise you? A couple of them actually surprised me because I've never tried to cut them before. It's not always true to say the lighter the color, the, the least likely it is to cut or engrave because some of those were very light, such as the turquoise. That one really surprised me. Um, again, a couple caveats to these tests is that your mileage is going to vary based on the manufacturer of your acrylic. Uh, your, and also, obviously, your settings. These settings I used were just settings I picked that I thought would work. Uh, I didn't take the time to fine-tune them. So you can actually get them to look a lot better than what I just illustrated, especially with the engraving. The engraving was, was pretty deep on them, and you're not going to want to engrave that deep. So even though it looked, a few of them looked a little rough, with some fine-tuning, I think they'd be perfectly acceptable for very light engraving. If you have any questions, put them in the comments. Thanks for watching.